In this video, we will see how logical operators can be used in C programming language. First of all, remember that the result of application of a logical operator is always Boolean. That is true or false. But in C programming language, usually true is represented uh, by a numerical value 1 and false is represented using numerical value 0. There are three logical operators. This is the symbol for logical end, double ampersand symbols. Uh, this is the logical operator R, logical R, uh, using two vertical bars. And this is logical not. So there are three logical operators which are supported by C programming language. Here are the truth tables. This is the truth table for logical end. Now you can see here, we can make out that the result of application of logical end is true if and only if both of its operands that is logical value of A as well as logical value of B is true then only output is true. Similarly, this is the truth table for logical R. Here you can observe that the logical value of A or B would be false if and only if both A and B have logical values false. Or you can say if any of uh, the two expressions or variables, logical variables or expressions A or B, if any one of them is true, A or B is and the third one is logical not. So if A is false, then not A is true and vice versa. By making use of a and or and not, we can construct four more logics which are commonly used. NAND, this is NAND, this is nor this is exclusive or this is exclusive or here and exclusive nor so these four can be uh, constructed by making use of and or and not so here's the to table for nand which is not and so we observe here that the result of a nand b is false if both both the expressions or variables, logical variables A and B are true, then only it will be false, otherwise it will be true. Similarly, A nor B would be true if both A and B are false. Here, in case of A exclusive or B or A X or B, the result would be A X or B would be true if both A and B are different, dissimilar. It means if A is false, B is true, result is true. If A is true, B is false, result is true. If both are same, then result is false. And the last one, A X nor B, it is true. If both A and B are identical, that is, if A and B are false, then the result is true. If A and B both are true, result is true, otherwise false. So, somehow we can say that it is nothing but the complement of, uh, uh, you can say, uh, A, uh, A, X or B, isn't it? So, when this is false, this is true, when this is true, this is false, so on. So I have made a simple program. Uh, let us see. In the bottom pane, I have shown the source code. So this line is for end logical end. This is for or. This is for not. Nand nor. This is xor x nor. I have taken just arbitrary example. So the only requirement is 
both the operands both uh, on both sides of these logical operators and or exclusive or nand nor and exclusive nor both must result in a boolean value both sides okay so any expression or a statement which results in boolean value can be used on uh, both the sides of these operators except not not is a unary operator it requires only one operand okay so now if i execute this program these are the values now you can see here this is the logical end first one is logical end this is logical end so you can see here 5 is less than 5.6 it is true and 5 is greater than 0 yes it is true so application of logical end to these two expressions is true and true is represented as 1 next one is or you can see here yeah so here 5 less than 5.6 it is true so in this case we need not to even observe this second uh expression minus 5 greater than 0 it is false but since first one is true so value would be true here this is the way we write the not is 5 less than 5.6 it is true so result has to be false because not of true is false you can see here it is 0 next one is nand you can verify output has to be 0 similarly nor the output has to be zero exclusive or okay exclusive or here it is zero we can see here this expression 5 less than 5.6 it is true 5 is greater than 0 it is true but not of true is false so this will be false okay and this part 5 less than 5.6 it is true so it's not is false okay so its result would be true okay and so on so this is not of this okay so this value is zero similarly you can verify that value of x nor here would be 1 okay so this is the way we can make use of logical operators present in C programming language That is all in this video thanks for watching